Well, President Joe Biden became the first sitting U.S. president since Bill Clinton in 2000 to give the keynote address at the NAACP Freedom Fund dinner. We heard some chance in the crowd of four more years as Biden seeks support for his reelection. Tonight, let's welcome the 46th president of the United States of America. Welcomed to a standing ovation, President Joe Biden receiving a Lifetime Achievement Award and giving the keynote speech at the 69th annual NAACP Freedom Fund Dinner, hosted by the Detroit chapter, the largest NAACP chapter in the country. Because of your vote, it's the only reason I'm standing here as President of the United States of America. Biden spent the day focusing on black voters, giving the commencement speech this morning at the historically black Morehouse College in Georgia, before heading to Detroit, where before the dinner, he made a stop at Cred Cafe, a new local black owned business on the east side. How important are black voters in the state of Michigan for his campaign? It'll be critical. We know how close it was in the last uh, elections and so forth. And then we see what the polls are already saying. So, you know, all these swing states are, uh, are going to be key. During his speech, Biden criticized the former president while also touting his own successes, especially for the black community. Our policies are resulting in historic lows of black unemployment. Black small businesses are starting up at the fastest rate they have in 30 years. We're opening the doors to generational wealth. In fact, the racial wealth gap is as low as level in 20 years. I support him 100 percent. Attendees we spoke to at the dinner strongly supporting his reelection. He's my president and I back him. So to hear him say all the things that he's done and the things that he's not getting credit for, to be able to be here and have a lot of other people hear those things. I see what my alternative is and uh, I can uh, support something like that. And former President Donald Trump is actually set to speak here in this same building in a couple weeks for a conservative conference as Michigan becomes front and center this election. In downtown Detroit, I'm Brett Cast, 7 News, Detroit.